All right, welcome to my channel, The Kingly Way. And my name is King, and right now, I am in the state of Utah, in the city of Saratoga Springs. So, I'm in a neighborhood with, you know, one of my mom's friends uh, owns a house out here. So, we're here to uh, get stuff into a U-Haul and then take it back to California. So, so a friend owns a home out here. So what I want to do is show you the scenery of how it looks from this neighborhood. All right, so follow along and I'll see you in a second. All right, so I'm back here. Now I'm walking down the street here and you know, I'm just looking at all the real estate here. There's so much building going on here in Utah. So apparently, you know, uh, what I've been learning is that uh, this could become the next Silicon Valley of the United States because since, for those that already know where Silicon Valley is located in the Bay Area of California, the housing market is just too expensive. So they're coming here. So you can see the old development companies here. They are building homes here. I mean, look at these homes. You know, look how they look. It's crazy. I mean, the average home on this block or neighborhood goes for at least three quarters of a million. You know, so people want people are trying to buy up the real estate, especially in the Midwest, because. People want to get away from states uh, like New York and California. I mean, the New York is like heading towards Florida. Most of the Californians are heading to Austin, Texas, you know, Utah, where I'm at now. And where else? And just, you know, even Las Vegas, because, yeah, the real estate is just ridiculously expensive and it's not even you know, worth living. But even here in Utah, I mean, yeah, it's even beautiful here. But it's gonna get really expensive here. It's already expensive. I go to a state like Kansas where, you know, I was there last week. You know, the housing cost is night and day. Uh, Utah's pretty nice, you know. You always get to look at the nice mountains you know with snow so that's a cool thing about this now this is eagle park that i'm taking you to so you can probably i think you can even park your car here if you like but this is like a nice little trail i mean look at this look at the lake the ocean only problem is like where you know my mama's friends are located he is located in Saratoga Springs, which is the other side of this lake. But if you go on the other side of the lake, that's where uh, Provo, where the University of Brigham Young University is there, BYU, and Oram. So those are the things that are down there. Okay, so one thing I do enjoy is I could stare at this all day. I mean, look at that. Like, even in the summer, you know, the mountains are still snow white. Oh, and they even have uh, bathrooms here for you, in case you need it. Yep. So, okay. So, you need to actually swipe your homeowner's card. So, here's the thing about the bathrooms here, which is pretty cool. And you got, you know, security cameras. You got to use your owner's uh, swipe key to use a bathroom. So, you can't just use the bathroom. So, if I need to use the bathroom I'm SOL I'm out of luck but wow take a look at this I mean this is really nice I mean I could stare at this all day long you know in the mountains look at that and uh, the rumor is uh, they're looking to uh, build a bridge here to extend 30 because it's about 35 miles is lake to you know you know uh to to you know fight the congestion because it does get crowded the traffic because if i wanted to go to like provo orem or lehigh you gotta so if i 
pan the camera, you have to circle all the way around to get there, and that takes too much time. So, so if they could build a bridge going from here from Saratoga Springs to you know Provo, that would just make things a little easier. And uh, the only thing that uh, I dealt with was okay, you know, I uh, helped set up where to pick up the U Haul. So, first, I had the U Haul. Uh, scheduled to be picked up here in Saratoga Springs which is only 10-15 minutes away then when we're on our way from California all the way here we got three different relocations so the next one okay Provo okay Provo still not too far to circle all the way around then the last one I was getting annoyed we had to go all the way to Huber City, which is an hour away just to pick up a U-Haul. So that's kind of like my frustration. I mean, of course, what I got, what we got out of it is we got an extra day, an extra 100 miles for it. So, you know, in case we need that little uh, leadway on the miles. But usually we're going to take one shot and go home back to California on Saturday. So me and my friend, we're going to drive the truck home. So that's pretty much where we're out here. That's the job of this thing. So yeah, so this is where it looks. Let me see if I can walk a little bit of the trail and see what we got here. I mean, look at these homes. Those are really nice homes. These are some nice backyards of their homes, as you can see. So let's uh, go down and see what else I can find. Um, I don't think I need to wear my jacket, but you know the weather changes a lot so i came in a week where the temperature 70 degrees all week but if uh but if i you know come next week it's gonna be 30 degrees so yep so but we do have a lot of you know companies from silicon valley moving into uh utah see so you can see a lot of things here so I'm gonna walk a little bit of the trail and then come right back I mean I could have done a live stream but you know it's gonna be but I didn't bring my pocket Wi-Fi with me so so you can see how things look as you can see if you look straight ahead look at the mountains all white so a lot of beautiful pictures of the white so I'm getting my walk in a little exercise so pretty nice and usually you know you don't have to deal with the things you deal with in big cities like California or New York New York or LA yeah I mean this is totally you know suburb now the thing about living out here in Saratoga is you do have a lot of HOAs, so they regulate you on what you can do with your house. And you pay, you know, almost a G a month for them to tell you what to do, you know. So that's a part I don't like if I was living in an area like this. I do not want to be told how to regulate my pad, you know. But, you know, that's what happens. And, and it's amazing because people... I don't see a lot of for home sales, maybe one or two. Compared to last week when I was in Wichita, Kansas, I don't even recall seeing one uh, place that had a for sale sign. You couldn't find it. You had to, it was like looking for a needle in a haystack. Here you could kind of see a few needles here in Utah. But yep, the real estate is just being bought up like crazy. So that's how it looks. All right. So I'm going to stop here because I do have to get back. I do have a long day because I will be going to Salt Lake City, uh, Utah to check out downtown, check out a few sites. And, you know, I have a few areas where I want to check out for, uh, for POD Sports Zone video. So I'm going to try to get to three sites today. And try uh, eating a, a crown burger, which is a pastrami hamburger. That's a thing here in Utah, I guess. So we'll see how it goes. All right, so 
yep so that's pretty much yeah what the plan is so by the way i did sneak outside the house to get footage check out the sights here so no one knows that i left i left all my <laughs> phone too so they're wondering where did i go so yep looking at the sights here yeah i mean i could stare at this all day so it's but if you want to have this uh, scenery you're gonna pay a lot for it you know especially on where I'm walking you're talking about three quarters of a million to a million dollars so if you got that kind of dough yep you can come live here but you know it's gonna get bad where I think it's gonna come to the point where it's gonna become it could become Everything is like, you know, out of everyone's price range pretty much. So, we'll see how it goes. All right. So, I'm heading back up. So, this is the thing, you know. So, yeah, it's pretty cool to see this. And plus, you got some little backup electricity. If they're suspicious, they could be calling you know, things on me. Like, what are those gentlemen doing here, you know? So yep but this is a pretty neat place to walk into if you want to walk the trail so and you know don't look too suspicious you know <laughs> maybe because i'm from l.a so that's a thing but yep look at that so you got mountains and snow on top of the mountains on each side here so it's pretty neat so i do like that and yeah here's the funny thing um i feel like i'm gonna sweat but i'm not sweating i think uh there, there's a thing that nas daily did about the sweating you don't really sweat so yeah so i'm i actually don't feel any sweat dripping down my hair yeah it's dry so that's the situation but yeah all right so yep let's show you the one last thing with the mountain, the trees are in the way, but that's how it goes. All right. All right, so everyone, if you enjoyed any of this content, please hit the like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in my next video.